Obviously, I'm thrilled to win it. I'm not saying that it isn't an absolute thrill to win it, but, but certainly it never entered my mind that I would. University of Waterloo Associate Professor Donna Strickland became only the third woman in history to win the Nobel Prize for Physics. Her work paved the way towards the shortest and most intense laser pulses ever created, leading to groundbreaking inventions in the field of laser physics. They did call at uh, 4.58 a.m. My husband's closer to the phone. We were still in bed uh, trying to sleep. Um, and they asked for Professor Strickland, and he handed it to me going, they're asking for Professor Strickland, because I had already been screaming, what's wrong? Strickland co-invented a method of generating high-intensity, ultra-short optical pulses, which has a variety of applications, including corrective laser eye surgery. The first woman to win a Nobel Prize in physics was Marie Curie, who won twice. She won first in 1903. The second woman was Maria Gopert Meyer back in 1963. She just followed her husband from job to job while he became a professor and went up the ranks and moved universities to do that as a chemist. And she would be allowed to teach if she wanted to, and she was allowed to have an office if she wanted to sit there and do some research on her own, but didn't get paid until the 50s. And yet the work I cited her was from 1939. And so obviously women have come a long way. I feel I get paid the same, and I felt like all along I've always been paid the same and treated the same. Well, with 55 years since the last woman won in physics, Strickland has become an inspiration to female science students. I saw that and I was like, no way. I did not expect that and I feel so proud. As a first year, I'm a first year. So as a first year, I was like, that's so in inspiring and that could be me. I just feel that it shows um, that we can do anything. Like we can do just as much as men and um, even more. Originally from Guelph, Strickland began teaching at the University of Waterloo in 1997. She says it was her father who first suggested she study laser technology. Did I ever think, oh, I should be doing something to help humanity? No, I just think if we all do what we're really good at, it just helps the world. That's all. Well, Donna Strickland says she hopes her win helps celebrate women physicists and that their numbers will grow in the future. In Waterloo, Audra Brown, City News. Yeah.